A massive manhunt tonight, officials desperately searching for the attacker who got away. This video from the DailyMail.com showing a man who may be Salah Abdeslam, the 26-year-old now the most wanted man on earth. His face now known to the world. <laughs> Salah and his brother Brahim, who blew himself up the night of the attacks, rented the three cars that delivered the gunmen to their killing sprees. One of the cars later found with three AK-47s inside. Salah also rented this hotel room in a Paris suburb in the days before the attacks. He grew up here in Molenbeek, Belgium, a neighborhood we visited in Brussels with a large Muslim immigrant population. And as Salah's brother Mohammed told me, home to many young men who have gone to Syria to train with ISIS. Salah ran a bar in Molenbeek. It was closed down just weeks ago after police found it was a haven for drug dealers. When I spoke to Salah's brother Mohammed, he told me both of his brothers liked to party. They have brothers who go out all day long, who may sometimes even go out two or three days without coming back home to sleep. Mohammed told me things changed recently when his brothers stopped drinking. He believes they became radicalized through the internet. Now Salah is on the run. I asked Mohammed what he wants to say to him. I would tell him to surrender. That's the best solution, to contact the authorities. His brother told me Salah Abdeslam is afraid to turn himself in. He may also fear retribution from ISIS for abandoning his childhood friend, the reported ringleader of the Paris attacks, Abdul Hamid Abaoud. But wherever Salah is, Mohammed has another message for him. These are my brothers. I love them. That's for sure.